beautiful welcome back to my channel and if you're new hi my name is alexis jada and welcome i already filmed this video but i did not like my vibe you guys my vibe was completely off i wasn't feeling it i was feeling the recording but i wasn't feeling like my mood you know like you know when something happens in your life like everyday life i was pissed Boing. I will be creating a look using these two palettes. I did just use this one at the beginning, but I think I'm gonna use this one to make it more intense. I will be playing with some new products. So let's get into it. I'm gonna zoom you guys in and let's get it in. So this is the NYX, the brow glue, instant brow styler. Everyone's going crazy over this. And this is in the shade transparent. One product, limited brow looks, non-sticky transparent formula. So you know how everyone in me included were doing the eyebrow trend, I wanna say like years, a year or two ago, I think. Well, when this came out, I seen it all over TikTok, all over Instagram, all over Facebook. And let's see if it's worth the freaking hype. So this is it. It looks like dirty soap water. I do want to see how it does apply just like this. Like if it does do that whole like eyebrow soap trend, 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 trend. Yeah, trend. I don't know why that sounds weird. Yeah, it's like giving the nice like flick, but I guess it's not supposed to be like crunchy, crispity, crunchy. I'm gonna let it sit for a little bit. So it is setting, but it's not crispy. Nice. All right. So let's just go in and let's use the Essence Micro Precise Eyebrow Pencil and I'm using the shade Dark Brown. Okay, I like to underline. And then I'm gonna go in on the top as well. A few of you guys asked me what I use to grow up my eyebrows and it is a main grow choice serum, I believe. I, I wanna say serum. I will leave it linked down below. At night, I always apply it and boom. Uh, a few of you guys have been part of my eyebrow journey. This one took forever to grow back, but when I started using that serum, she grew back. What's up? That is me filling in the brows. So, so we don't want the eyebrow to look harsh, so we're just gonna spoolie it in a little bit. Yeah, that brow stuff did set. I did want to see how it looked solita, you know? So that's why I applied it first. But it's no biggie, it's okay. We'll just go in and set it again. I feel like sometimes we feel like, oh, like we can't do that, like it's not supposed to be like that. Some things, yes, but other things it's like, it's okay, you know? No big deal. It's gonna be alrighty. I still can work in that product. You see how it's like making it really easy just to still move it around? I like that. So there is that eyebrow then i'm just gonna do the other one and then we're gonna start going in with the eyes all right so i've been seeing this look go around it's freaking beautiful gorgeous i already told you this year we're stepping outside of the box the first time is a fail i don't want to put that up because i feel like i could do better and i was just really letting my emotions get the best of me so let's go in and add concealer i'm gonna go in with my all-time favorite it's already almost done this is my l'oreal infallible concealer this is in the shade latte we are the same skin complexion that one is perfect for us now i'm gonna go in with a paint brush flat brush and we are just going to just carve like our eyebrows and then add the all over our lid. Okay, so for this, I'm gonna go in with uh, Makeup Shack T29. And we are just going to add this all over our lid. You hear the chewing, it's Jade. All right, so we got our base down. I'm gonna go in with the Shop Miss A Shadow Shields. So I used this in a previous video. I did not cut them up until now because you can save more monies, even though they're a book. I didn't have scissors the first time around, so. Ooh, should I do it? I don't know. I wasn't gonna put this, but maybe this will help it look better. All right, so we're gonna go in with the Juvia's Place palettes. This one is Mauve's, and then this beautiful one is Berries. It is so beautiful, I'm telling you. Look how freaking beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. So we're gonna be using both. Yeah, we're gonna go with the Berries, and I'm going to use this shade right here. We're gonna go in with an angled eyeliner brush. I'm going to carve the eye. First, let's go here. Eyes, madre. Okay, ooh, I'm just kidding. 
right, now I'm gonna go in with Morphe and Jaclyn 39 Birch, this one right here. We're gonna go in with that same color and we are going to blend it, okay? We're going to blend all of this. It's okay to bring it right here because we're gonna end up using this as eyeliner. So if we fill this two times, then it's like, andale Alex, it's like, what are, you, what are you doing? I'm gonna go with the Morphe E17, go back in with that same color, and we're going to diffuse it just a little bit more. And just take your time blending, going back and forth, circular motions, back and forth. So just to deepen it up a little bit, I'm gonna go in with this shade right here. That pink is absolutely, it's not even a pink. It's like a deep wine, but it looks like a pink diffused. Beautiful. So I'm gonna go in here just to bring that color in there as well. Let's go in with my Bellum Tools 75. We're gonna go in with the Moves palette and we're gonna go in, go in with this shade right here. Use that at the store. And then we're gonna apply it right above. She's such a daddy's girl. All right, so now we're going to cut the crease. I'm gonna use a P. Louise. This one is Winter Rose. So cute. Add some of that. A little bit goes a long way, so you don't need too much. You just need just a knife. So now we're gonna go in with the mauves and we're going to add this shade right here all over our lid. And we're using the Makeup Shack T41. So we're gonna go in there. So, okay. Now we're gonna add it to our eye. Mm. I'm gonna do it very lightly because I like that color that we already laid down. If anything, we can switch things up. We can, nothing needs to stay the same. We can add a little slunting slunting to it. You know what I mean? You know what I mean to the bean? I, I do wanna go in with uh, Makeup Shack T63. And I'm just gonna go back in there just to define the crease a little bit more and go in with this shade. Now we're gonna go in, grab the same brush, we're gonna go back in with that same color and we're going to add it right here. I'm just going to add this. Then to blend it, we're gonna go in with the Jacqueline brush right here. Pick up that shade and we're going to blend it right here. Hiya, Luma. That looks pretty. Okay, okay, okay. So we're almost done with the eyes. So let's remove this. Ooh, that gave it a nice crisp. Super smart. I'm glad that I went back and did it. I love it again. All right, so the next product I wanna try that is new is the Maybelline Sky High. This one right here. Y'all already know I got baby lashes. This went crazy over the internet. See my lashes? You can't see them. They're looking down. If you guys know where that's from, let me know. So it says limited, limitless length full volume. So here is the mascara. Here is the applicator. It looks pretty cool, cool. So again, here are my lashes. Where? Let's see if they really work, okay? So. I mean, I'm like not too crazy about it. There has been mascaras where I'm like, oh my gosh, like the Essence mascara, love that. That has me like by my werewolves, you know? But this, I bet you guys see. I don't know, maybe because I wear false lashes, I'm expecting some like voom voom voom, or I don't know, and the models that they have for this campaign too, like the lashes are beautiful already, you know? Now some people are just Jesus's favorite, so it just looks beautiful on them. Like it's nice, I see that what it's doing and stuff, it's nice, but I don't know y'all, I'm not really like wowed. There's another coat. See, it's starting to just look spidery. Like, they look like they're throwing up gang signs, you know, like, which queen cut, but yeah. My sister-in-law loves it, but I think where I don't have those really pretty lashes, I'm kind of like, eh, very picky about my mascara, but this, it's all right. And I don't want to lie to you guys, because some of you guys have been asking me about it. I don't want to lie, I don't want to lie. So I am going to go in with the Too Faced, Eyelashes, and this one is in Drama Queen. It looks pretty. I'm glad what, that I went with these lashes. They're so pretty, Mina. Oh, you guys, I wanted to tell you. So I'm gonna be um, doing my hair again. I got these sent to me by L'Oreal. So, oh, 
see that. This is a L'Oreal Le Color Gloss. One Step Toning Gloss. Boost shine, enhances color, and deeply conditions. No damage, no mix. You can use it up to three applications. So I think I'm going to use Cool Burnette. They also sent a clear one, and I bet me have. This is how it looks. So cute, so fancy looking. Like, what the <gasps> heck? No. And they sent me a rich brunette. The mail is here. Come on. It's not that Woo! Oh, I just got a mail. It is the color pop black. We will be donating 100% of the profit of. The Make It Black collection to pull up for change. Small businesses impact fund. Make it black. I'm gonna have to do a separate video. I thought they were gonna have blushes in here, so I was like, I'll use the blushes. But I will definitely do a separate video. But I did want you guys to see. So we have two gel cream liners. We have four lippy sticks. We have the shade Like Magic, Galore, Pitch. I love this matte. Then we have the Super Shock. That is awesome, that is amazing. Thank you so much too, ColourPop. I do want to try some new primer and foundation. I will be doing a separate video dedicated to the foundation process. But I do want to apply it so you guys can see me using new products. So this is the Glass Correct Primer. Skin looks naturally corrected and reflective as crystal. This yellow color correcting filter brightens and corrects dullness for glowing complexion. Includes vitamin C with radiance boosting properties. Wear alone or prep skin for long lasting makeup. I don't know why I want like that. Oh, okay. So we're gonna go on this side. On this side. It's looking really yet oh, yeah. Okay. I should have done one side so you can see the difference. But I got them ahead of myself. I'm very excited. I'm glad. I feel like sometimes we're in the funk. Feels good when you start feeling yourself come out of that funk, you know? You're like, come on, girl. Come on, girl. <gasps> Pull it, girl. Pull it, girl. Oh, okay, I need to stop. Hey! Guess this! Next thing in here, this is new. This is a Wet n Wild Tainted Hydrator. This has all hyaluronic acid in it. It's a sheer to medium. This oil-free protector de delivers hydrating benefits in a buildable sheer to medium tint for a flawless, softly luminous complexion. So I did pick up the shade medium tint. I'm hoping it matches me. We'll do a quick, and if this one doesn't match me, I did order some other foundations I wanted to test out. How the hell is that a medium tan? Do you oxidize? I'm gonna give you a chance, cause I'm gonna be pissed. That looks pale. That looks like vanilla. Mm. So fam, help me out if you have tried this out and we are the same skin complexion, please let me know so I know which one to grab. Let's move on to another one that I did purchase. This is the e.l.f. Camel CC Cream. And I know there's been so much hype over this, so I'm so excited. This is a medium 330W. W. Let's try it out. You'll never find blah, 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 blah. What's that from? They just put it on Netflix. I've been watching it nonstop. Oh, you see, this looks like a medium tan, okay? This! Whatever. Let's see, we're going to... Looks that eyebrow. God damn! Color correcting full coverage. What? Apply one to two pumps of CC. That is very full coverage. All right, so look at that. Dang, okay, okay, okay. We'll do brush. And then we'll do the equals tool that I purchased. And I am excited to try. Morphe G36. And I'm just going to just add this. Oh my god! Jade, this looks good, Jade. This looks good. Yeah. I'm very happy. Oh, your brothers are here. Huh? Yeah, go see. Dang, you guys. Oh my goodness. That looks, this is a CC cream. Are you trying to come for it cosmetics's neck? Sir, ma'am? So here is the side. This is the brush side. Like my skin looks luminous. It looks beautiful. And then we're going to go in with the Bio Blender Equal Tools 100% bio Biodegradable Makeup Sponge. This is it. 
which is we need more sponges like this, you guys. So here's the sponge before it's wet. So this is it wet. We're gonna go in. And then we are going to blend. Look how freaking full, guys, I'm tripping out. I'm like literally tripping out. Like look how good coverage that is. How? So here is brush side. Sponge side. Like, I think I like both sides. Maybe the one with the brush, a little bit more. I'm really like, wow, about this. Seriously, wow. Let's stay with e.l.f. Since I got the e.l.f. concealer, I got this e.l.f. one that says, Flawless Brightening Concealer, and I did pick up the shade Medium 33W. Same as the, okay. Apply this. Ooh. All right, now let's go in with the sponge. Really get in there. I wouldn't normally go for that concealer color, but it looks pretty good. Not mad at it. Alrighty, so I'm gonna finish my face and I'll be right back. Another new item that I got is the Milani All-Inclusive Eye Cheek Face Eye Palette. I just got this today, so I'm really excited. So this is it right here. That is so beautiful. Let's go in and let's bronze our face. I'm gonna grab this shade right here. Ooh, that is pretty. Beautiful. I'm gonna go in with this shadow shade. It's like a light bronzy shade and I'm just going to just contour the nose very lightly. Very lightly. Now let's go in with the blush. So they have two blushes. I'm gonna go pew pew, pew 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 pew, like that. To be honest, I did not think I was going to like it this much. Like, I really like it a lot. Now let's go into the highlight. Oh, I wanna go in with a little bit right here. I have to. I wanna go in with a little bit of the highlight. And where there's already pink there, it's making it, ooh. This, beautiful. Why am I not seeing it all over TikTok? All right, I'm gonna go in with my Maybelline Fix It. Oh, I'm just gonna go over with the sponge so there's no like any of those like dots or how it just went and spit in my face. All right, so now let's move on to our under eye. We still gotta make it go. So I'm gonna go in and we're gonna use Joga Cosmetics really pretty pink liner. I'm tripping over how good the foundation. Let's not even face the foundation. It's a CC cream. All right, now let's go in and we're going to use the shade right here, the same that we used in our crease. I'm just going to add that right underneath. Boom. I will be going in with that Maybelline. Maybe it's Maybelline. Mm, beautiful. Okay, I'm gonna go in with a brown lip liner. I'm using the Cardi. Bible. We lined it. Now we're gonna go in with the new Maybelline. There's a lot of new Maybelline products. Maybelline Ultimate Color Sensational Matte Lipstick. And I grabbed the shade More Taupe. Pretty brown. You know I'm a bitch for brown. Yeah. Oh, I love how the look looks today compared to yesterday. Like it looks so much better, you guys. Feel better, todo. Alrighty, love. So this is the finished look. I'm really tripping out with how good the CC cream was. Skin loving ingredients like collagen, peptides. I think I even like it more than the It Cosmetics one. I need to do a comparison of both of them. I really wasn't disappointed. The only thing where I was just like, this wasn't worth the hype. It wasn't, maybe I just got like dumb lashes or something, but it honestly was not worth the hype that I was, I really thought it was going to like, but it didn't, like it didn't. But yeah, everything else I really did enjoy, especially this, the two things that really got me, the Milani and the Elf. And the Juvia's Place palettes, you already know, they're just amazing. But those are the two things where I was like, like oh, that is very nice. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did, please give me a big thumbs up and subscribe if you guys haven't already to keep updating my videos. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.
Oh, tag me in photos of makeup looks you guys want me to try so I can start stepping outside of my box more. So do that for me, please. I would greatly appreciate it. I love you guys. Bye. Go on, you do So thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed, please make sure you give us a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you guys haven't. 